Creating a safe place for your families to conduct a child exchange for court order visitations is what the Cleveland County Sheriff's Office is looking to do with a new Safe X program. Now we've got Rep Burnett and Candace Gabrielle Gabriel from the Cleveland County Sheriff's Office to talk about the program. How are you guys doing? We're great. Great. Well, thank you so much for coming and talking to us about mm -hmm. this really important program that y'all have got getting going. Can you just start off by explaining what it is? Well, for a while I had heard stories about people that were trying to exchange kids and perhaps one of the parties in their and an, and an ex relationship wasn't very cooperative or children were exposed to fights and arguments and violence. Yeah. And uh, I always wanted to try and do something about that. And Sheriff Lester says, Sheriff Joe Lester said, sure, create something. And uh, I'm kind of creative, but not that creative. Yeah. And I thought of an idea and uh, pitched it to Candace and she kind of ran with it. So we created the Safe X program and it's basically creates areas where people can go that they know are under video surveillance, right. where if they have an exchange with a child, uh, both parties know that that area is being video surveilled and if any kind of a violence occurs, that uh, the place that they're at will cooperate with law enforcement in prosecution of any kind of crime that occurs. Well, it sounds like you got a heart for kids, mm -hmm. both of yes. you guys. That's obviously what this is all about, absolutely. right? Absolutely, absolutely. It's about kids. It's protecting the kids and making mm -hmm. sure that they're okay. Is that was was that the motivation? Yeah, that's the motivation. Our children, you know, uh, I'm an older guy, and, and I know that my that my future is dependent on our kids today and our teens. Mm -hmm. uh, our world's future is dependent on our kids. I sure want my children to do something better than with a, with their future than what I uh, than what I leave them. And so we've got to limit the exposure to violence. We've got to limit the exposure to tra trauma to our kids and this is just one way that people in Cleveland County can do that. Was there a need for this? Was, was there parents asking for this? What, what made y'all decide to get this going? Uh, yeah, there's definitely a, a need for it. The last thing we want is for a kid to feel uncomfortable right. uh, when their parents are in the middle of exchanging them. Um, and we've had lots of phone calls of parents concerned on, you know, what is it uh, that this program is doing? You know, can this help uh, this exchange be a little bit easier? And so it, it's definitely a need within the county for yeah. sure. Kids are little Geiger counters. They pick up on any yeah. kind of tension yeah. or stress going on all the time. And, right. and if they know, if they know uh, mom and dad are are, are not going to have a good exchange. They're already upset. And if mm -hmm. we can go somewhere where both adults, uh, knowing where they're at under video surveillance, they yeah. may act like adults. That, that's an awesome situation for the kids. And how did all this come together? How's it getting paid for? Was there outside funding? Or was this just something that that, that y'all put together? Yeah, we put it together. Sheriff Lester said, yep, I'll pony up the cost of it. And right now, all it's really cost us is, a, is some uh, blue paint. Yeah, oh, uh, awesome. We've got uh, uh, partnerships with uh, people in the community, with businesses in the community yeah. uh, that have agreed and said, hey, we have video surveillance. We'll let you paint X's on some parking spots. Uh, mm -hmm. Candace uh, contacted a bunch of different local vendors and they're willing to do that. And we put their information on all of our paperwork so people know they, hey, these people in the community are part of it. Okay, what do parents need to know? What do families need to know if they are interested in doing this? Uh, if they go to our website, ccso-ok.us, you can go on to the SafeX, uh, click on the logo there, and it will give you all the information about the SafeX program, and it will tell you all of the location, give you exact map locations okay. on where everything is located. Okay. And also on our app, we have a free mm -hmm. app uh, right. that you can download, and it's available right there. We wanted to put it in their hands so they could see it. Guys, thank you so much for coming out and Absolutely. getting the information out because there's obviously need for it. Mm -hmm. There's probably some people at home right now that are thinking, man, mm -hmm. that's exactly what I need. So thank mm -hmm. you for coming and sharing it with us. No, we yeah. appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks All for the right, chance. Guys, thanks a lot. <laughs>